FIFA 21 deadline day. It is a promotion from EA Sports. They do offer a pack that you can earn the deadline day pack. We're going to be talking about what exactly is it, how can you earn it, and also when are we going to be getting it, receiving it in Ultimate Team as that reward. And also touching on already what we do know a little bit. When are we going to be getting our pre-order one to watch pack? How is it different to this? And also FIFA 20 pre-season rewards. When are we going to be getting them in FIFA 21? So getting straight into this video now, make sure you guys do watch till all the way till the end so you do fully understand it. But essentially what this FIFA 21 deadline day promotion is, it's just a simple marketing tactic from EA Sports to try and get some more last minute pre-orders on any edition really, standard, ultimate and champions edition. This qualifies for all of them and it is going to be to make sure also they do have high active users playing FIFA 21 on the first day because of course that does look good on the company for of course their shareholders everything like that it does look good if they do have more players actively playing FIFA 21 more hype and hopefully their stock price of EA does go up that is how they are thinking but for us of course how can we earn this deadline day pack and we are going to be actually receiving it on or before October 16th so we don't have to wait for it so the way we do earn it is just by playing FIFA 21 the full game so EA play does not count and we do need to play it before the full day of the release does actually end so it does come out on October 9th we do need to play before 8 p.m. UK time so for example if you do have ultimate or champions edition and you are already waiting to play tonight you are just going to automatically qualify you don't have to do anything else just when you log on to FIFA 21 on your console again it cannot be EA play it does need to be the full game any version and you are going to be getting this reward so what is the the reward the reward there is a four one to watch loan cards and that of course isn't really too interesting at all they only have a four match loan on each of them and you're only going to be getting four of them they will actually upgrade so maybe if you just keep them and then of course see if they do upgrade you can just use a loan card if you want nothing too special possibly foot friendlies you can keep playing with it but interestingly we are going to be getting an untradeable team of the week card that is why I did want to record this video and and also we can keep this so for example if we don't like team of the week 2 we can even keep it longer and we can choose whenever we want to open it imagine if you do get an untradeable Lewandowski or someone like that that would just be absolutely insane if he does get an inform in team of the week 2 but anyway moving on from that deadline day pack hopefully you guys should get that even if you do get standard edition you are going to be getting that at the start of October 9th right at midnight from October 8th to 9th to go ahead and play if you for 21 so I do think a lot of us are just automatically going to get this without thinking about it and also now talking about the pre-order pack so if you did get ultimate edition by August 14th I definitely did myself I made sure I ordered it a few days before so I will get this you are going to be getting one untradeable one to watch card and this should be given out I assume when the full game does come out on October 9th that is how we had it last year and past FIFA's so I do assume it is going to be when the full game does drop and also pre-season objectives you might remember doing a few of these in FIFA 20 those rewards should be out by the 23rd of October that is what this message did pop up back in FIFA 20 back then it did say October 23rd but there have been a few dates flying around October 16th so I'm not really too sure but definitely this one does say October 23rd so maybe they are going to be coming out a week apart we are going to see because there were quite a lot of pre-season objectives let me know down in the comments below if you guys do have any of these preseason objectives from FIFA 20 and also are you going to qualify to get that deadline day pack I think most of us are thank you guys for watching this video I hope you guys enjoyed and I'll see you next time